One more world. World 4. It's the last area. Yeah, this is a really short game. You can 100% it in one sitting very reasonably. Okay, good start so far. One button. There's a Spriteling nearby and there's a treasure here. No shot! They expect me to memorize that. Boy, I'm stupid. You don't have to memorize that. There's an easy way. You just do it while it's flashing. I keep overthinking these, dude. Yeah, you can just do it while it's flashing. You don't have to memorize all 10. What are these things supposed to be? Get away from me. Okay. Get that. Oh, wait. There. There's no way you know this is here unless you use the mirrors. Oh, I picked someone up. Okay. Where is it? I think I'm standing on it. Nice. <laughs> oh my god, dude. What am I looking at? Oh, I'm getting nauseous. I hope I just speedrun it. That's always- No! What if I speedrun it? Part 2. Just speedrun it. Don't wait. Yes! Oh my god. Okay, I saw that. The reflection. Hey, wake up. <laughs> I need a ride. Oh. What the heck is this? This is a weird enemy. Oh, okay. Clearly don't throw it. Oh, you pile driver. It doesn't look right because like it doesn't look like I'm hitting it. That's why. What even is this enemy? It's such a weird design, as with 95% of this game. What the? He's like chained up! Why you got Eevee's hat too? What the hell? No, I don't mind eating a piece of garlic. Dude, Jason, go away. Yeah, bro, you ain't no, you ain't no Jason Voorhees. Jason doesn't go down that easily. I feel like there's a battle ring below, so I'll bring one of you with me. Oh, come on, really? These guys don't go down easy, huh? All right, give me my money. Damn, I have 13,000 coins. This is a lot, I think. And there's a lot of paths I can take. Okay, let me go left first. What the hell are these things? It looks like that Weber guy from Dokkaban Kingdom. That guy that adds nothing of value to the game but to waste your time. Hey, I need a ride. This is my Uber. <laughs> All right, let me set you free. Some monsters can only be seen in mirrors. Interesting. Wait, I got this treasure, but I think there's something there. Yeah, what's below here? Ah, I see. Oh, another one of these guys? I don't even know how to describe it. It's like a twisted version of Master Hand and Crazy Hand. Oh, it's the head bouncing around hitting them. I see. I think I just have to direct it more towards the arms just to really guarantee the hit. There we go. Get me out of here. That scared me. <laughs> Why is this here? Oh my... Okay, there's so much. Hold on. One at a time. Let me hit that. I get this. Wait, this is the end. Wait, what? There's still so much I need to do. Hold up. I am not done with this level just yet. Oh, a Spriteling. The mean MC inside the goal is a coward. Even if you bang the cup he's hiding and he won't come out, but don't give up. He's definitely hiding inside that cup. Well, thanks for the tip. Oh. I like that. Oh, I see the... No, I already pressed the button. No, it's up there. Okay, wait, hold on. I need to get up here now. Wait, how do I get up though? Okay, clearly that's the way to do it. Okay, there was one section, I think. I was not in this right section. Oh, the treasure. Nice. Nice, okay. And then there's one more thing I gotta pile drive. Oh my god, what is this? This is all about trusting physics, huh? Okay, so far so good. I can get the jewel immediately. Wait. Yeah, I had a feeling I was gonna overshoot that. Yeah, at least the first two are easy enough. I can get it consistently. Okay, that one I really gotta adjust then. Okay, good enough. Perfect. Yeah, you gotta short hop it. Ooh, I got all the health too? Nice, a level I don't have to restart and do like two or three times. I could just do it once and get out of here. Wait, it's actually Eevee. No way. Okay, he starts hiding, right? Yeah. Okay, it's this one. Wait. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense! Yeah, you can't trick me. This is the only game I've ever seen where it does something like that. Where you have to pick something and then he actually tries to juke you. Where are you going? Oh my. Okay, wait. I think it's this one actually. Oh yes, thank you. <laughs> This is so stupid. I do love the concept, though, where you have to pick one and then have faith that you pick the correct one by trying again. Okay, there's one more world, actually. Like, the chapter, the world boss, and then the final boss, which is the Black Jewel. Yeah, this game's hella short.
has a very yeah desert theme to it as well we got mummies out here this thing is actually just a time waster you're joking that's not a ledge oh my god go all the way back then there's still a red chest i've not gotten which is at the very beginning i need to find the red button though why it's just a big waste of time I'm just gonna tombstone you. Get out of my face. A wall! Uh huh. Okay, you can't ground pound. You can't jump from below to raise it above, so that is what's tricky about this one. What if it hit one into it? Oh. Interesting. What? <laughs> oh, I think I see what happens. Uh, kind of? It's a way to hit it so you hit it from below. Yeah, like that. Yeah, I totally saw this puzzle. Makes so much sense. Stone Cold Statue? Stone Cold Steve Austin? Alright, here we fight the second boss for whatever reason. This guy got demoted to a basic enemy, it seems. Well, I suppose not basic enemy, but he got demoted. Alright. Oh, he's got four life this time on top. He got less life. He got demoted and he has less life. Damn, that's depressing. Oh. Whoa. What? I guess it gave me a nice view of the entire level. How do I go up, though? Whoa. What? Sure. Well, from the past one, you just do that, right? Yeah. But now what? Oh, wait, I get it. Correct idea, wrong execution. You just gotta grump on this. Yeah. Oh my- Why? Right idea, semi-right execution. There we go. I don't have any idea how this works. Oh, thank you. That was very helpful. Oh, great. Leave me alone. Just leave me alone. Oh, thank you. Whoa. What the heck are you? You look like something from Subspace Emissary. I'm stuck. What? Oh, he's inhaling me. What? <laughs> I was wondering, like, why am I stuck? Yeah, bro's inhaling me with his nostrils. I don't smell that good, do I? What the hell? You are joking. If this is how you're supposed to do this, how is a kid supposed to figure that one out? I still have no idea how that works. I'm just like winging it. Okay. I think I've activated both buttons remaining. I just gotta find him now. Oh god, I gotta get rid of this guy before, I, before he starts smelling me aggressively. Oh my god, this is such a weird, annoying enemy. Thank you. Hear the sprightling. He's like right there. Oh, no shot. No shot, that's how you're supposed to do it. Oh my god, that feels so cheesy. Ooh, the last treasure's a GameCube. How fitting. Okay, that's a freebie. Nice. Oh, this is already not how you do it. I don't even know how you go about it. Is that thing? Like, do you have to raise it? Oh, I feel like you can just cheese it by doing that. I guess I just need to bring it closer to the center. But, uh, how do I go about that? Wait. I can kind of cheese it like this? What? <laughs> There's a ceiling pit? Wait, what? No! <laughs> oh, easy game. <laughs> what an easy puzzle, bro. What the fuck am I looking at? Well, these warriors getting that exercise and... I'm the last Sprightling prisoner. There are 40 of us all together, you know. How many did you save? Well, I did save all 40 of you, so... I got the best ending then. Technically, I've done the game now. All I gotta do is kill the three next bosses. This world's boss... Well, this level's boss, rather. The world four boss, and then the final boss. Oh, the typical face and two hands. This is the most Nintendo boss ever. Uh, can I just throw it? Yes, I can. Well, this is pitifully easy for a last boss. As I say that. Damn, you can speedrun this boss. No, not the onion ring attack. Oh, that one was really fast. There you go. Easy peasy, like the most of the other bosses. Okay, two more fights and this game is done for good. I think this is a pirate themed boss, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, this guy, Captain Skull's Showdown. All right, that's really bouncy for whatever reason. All right, come here. I'm gonna give you the Zangief treatment. What? Bro, that's cheating. The rope's gone in my way, that's why. Ah, he's got some invincibility frames now. What if I think outside the box? 
There we go. Then we get rid of you like this. Okay, stay there real quick. Stay there real quick. Stay there real quick. Thank you. I actually don't know what you're supposed to do if you don't have enough barrels to kill them then. Well, regardless, the last boss is complete. World 4 is complete. Now there's one boss remaining. The final boss inside that treasure chest. Now, this boss, if I recall, is actually not that great. Because it's very repetitive. I'm about to jog my memory with this. What the hell? <laughs> that was instantaneous. Oh my god, this thing just wastes... Again, this thing just wastes your time, man. Thank you. I give you the Zanky treatment now just to speed things up. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is why this boss is just kind of whatever, because it, it's so repetitive. And again, with a bunch of stuff that just wastes your time. Like the flame walls. Yeah, like these flame walls do nothing to, but just waste my time. And like this stuff is not hard to dodge. Yeah, this boss isn't that great. <laughs> Like, I'm just gonna take the hit. I don't care. <laughs> there. Oh! This is the end of Warrior World. You know what? Let's do one perfect rotation to finish it off. How about that? Send him off to the abyss. Oh, never mind. Uh, Warrior, what do you have to think about this final boss? My thoughts exactly. As a reward, we're going to rebuild your ruined castle. It's the same thing as Luigi's Mansion. If you don't do well, then you'll get a terrible ending. But yeah, I have everybody. No one's locked in jail cells still, so... I'm pretty sure I 100 percent of this game. Like all the treasures too and all the hearts. Which is how you're truly supposed to beat this game.